We're stuck at traffic lights just outside of Monaco, right in the hills where Seb's villa slash mountain house was that we stayed at for top marks. And uh, we've had an interesting drive into Monaco. We've seen so many cars, more Ferraris than anything. Only an Lots Aventador and a 560 Spider, not yeah. many Lambos. Loads of Ferraris. Um, and basically, we are going to try and find all of the cars we can find to put on camera. Yes. Yes, Monaco. Right, so we have made it to Monaco and you can hear the Formula, Formula GP2 cars. You can't at the moment because there's a van outside, but there's GP2 cars flying around. We're going to head down now um, as central to Monaco as we can get because the access is going to be very limited. Can you hear the cars? No, that's just people talking. And we've just filmed the first intro to our long weekend bank holiday challenge in Monaco with Sam, where we're doing a supercar spotting challenge and we've both challenged each other to three cars that we have to go and find all weekend. So I probably won't bang on too much about that in the vlogs and that's gonna be its own separate video which will go out at the end of the week. And the loser buys dinner. Oh, so, I'm feeling hungry. So if I lose, we're going to McDonald's. This is like the first hotel that we've checked. And there's a 177 a stunning FF and a 599 GTO with uh, XX bits. So uh, if this is anything to go by. So far back to get a picture of it. Got a couple of cars here, 599, BMW i8 through there, F12 here. But this is so cool. Our bellies, and now we're wandering around the non-restricted areas of Monaco. We've got the Ferrari dealership right up ahead, and McLaren to our right, where Lewis Hamilton. Sure there's a special over. Yeah. Yeah, yellow one. Oh, is that 570? It is. Let's go and have a look at it. It's the first one I've seen. Let's cross. Let's cross at a zebra crossing because we're just obeying by the law. Safety first. Safety by first. So this is the first look at the 570S. And I've got to say, for 140K or whatever, this is stunning. I think this is McLaren's best looking car, minus the P1, obviously. People, people keep seeing the backwards, I think the back looks really cool. I think the back is quite cool, wow. And it's got the same... As an R8, as an R8 sort of rival, this is uh, an interesting one for sure. Ooh, yum, getting in Sam's picture. Let me know what you think in the comment box below on the new baby McLaren. Oh, yeah. Doors are open, third car in, Haman Kali. That's ridiculous. Lucky I was filming. Yeah. Formula One driver. Somewhere in there you'll see Massa. So we're back now, <laughs> vlog inception, and we are heading back down to Casino Square. There's one Audi. This is an Audi advert. Two Audis. Three Audis coming up. And basically, we're gonna be heading down now, and hopefully, fingers crossed, things are gonna be kicking off.
let me know which one you would have a huge choice of McLaren. No, there's one choice of McLaren, one choice of Lambo, and plenty of choice of Ferrari, as there always is in Monaco. So behind me is a ton of supercars which I've just filmed, and as I was just filming them and taking pictures for Instagram, two 599s, California, there's just supercar after supercar here, and they all seem to be Ferrari. Things are looking is, up, mate. Yeah, this is your favorite. <laughs> there is a McLaren over there. There's one McLaren there, one Lambo. And it's getting a bit ridiculous, if I'm completely honest. And um, I don't really know what else to say. Have you already posted the Liberty Walk? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I'm winning. So we filled our bellies. We've had a McDonald's, which is located there. And we've walked out to a brand new Audi R8 V10 and a Hurricane right behind it. But what I really want to show you is the yacht out there that has a helicopter on the front. So it's 11 o'clock now, we've got a 16M Aventador, two Porsches, badass black series. A few cars around here, we've got a 458 over there, a McLaren there, Mansory Syracuse 458 Spider there. And then we get to the cool stuff. Over here, the Liberty walks back and this time it's being joined by a London favourite, the DMC. A Ventador Roadster with the Capristo test pipes, stupidly loud. So that's a pretty cool combo to have. And then... 458, a scooter here. Round here, we quickly go. McLaren and another 458 over there, and I'm rushing now. We've got an R8 and an Aston Martin, I think that is it. We came back to Casino because Sam had said that a 599 Mansory Syracuse had parked up. Oh no, Mansory Stallone, sorry, and I've just seen it. So we're going to do a lap. There's a 348. How insane is the Casino? Let me know what car you'd have in your garage. Tons of 458s, tons of Lamborghinis. Let me know. We are now reunited with one of the most famous cars off the Supercars of London YouTube channel. This isn't the same one. However, it is a Mansory Stallone. Boom. Whoop. Look at the carbon. We have just been informed that there is a, a LaFerrari somewhere this way. So we're on a storm. We are on a mission. <laughs> Sam's vlogging. <laughs> we have caught up with it. There's a California. Bloody hell.
swarm of people descends. gentlemen I don't even know what the time is anymore but I've got the silver Enzo behind me it is absolutely jam-packed there's music playing this is just one huge party and I cannot believe that I'm here and a part of this documenting all of the supercars that are driving around this is just insane and this is just day one race weekend hasn't even started it's gonna be absolutely crazy tomorrow and everyone says Saturday night and Sunday night are even better than Friday night. So if that's anything to go by, make sure that you are staying tuned on Supercars of London because this is just absolutely chaotic. I will see you tomorrow and then again on Sunday. I hope to continue to create all of these videos on a daily, day, daily basis and maybe try and get two videos per day. But it's goodbye from me and that Enzo's going to stay there. So. See you later guys, thanks for watching.